Hey everyone, I'm back with another unboxing video. Uh, before I get into anything, I just want to mention a few things real quick. First off, I am actually filming this in my kitchen, and as you could probably tell, I do have a few towels put down just to create more of a white background to try to enhance the lighting. Um, so hopefully that works. Uh, second, if you hear any noises in the background, it's most likely my dogs or a cat. So hopefully that won't be too disruptive or anything. But um, anyway, I know that I haven't really updated a lot. Mostly because I'm just horrible at updating. I procrastinate way too much. Not only that, but I have an extremely difficult time waiting to actually unbox packages. Um, literally, I could drive to the post office and I'll go with my mom. The second I run into the post office and actually get back into my vehicle, I'm pretty much ripping the box apart, even if I know what's already inside, just because I'm very impatient. Um, but not only that, my internet was down for a while, uh, but luckily I have it back now. So, anyway, on to the package. Now, I wasn't originally going to do an unboxing, but this was actually requested by the person who sent me this. So it's my good friend and um, she does have a YouTube channel, so please, I'd really appreciate it if you would check her out, message her, subscribe to her channel. Uh, she's a really dear friend of mine. Uh, her name is Sierra Faith and I'll leave her info down in the description below um but anyway this unboxing actually has a funny story behind it so a while ago i sent her a package and i will admit that i used a little too much tape not only on the box but on the items inside with bubble wrap and tape and then i taped the box so, when she received the package, she told me that she fought with the package itself for quite a while trying to open it. So, time went on, and I totally forgot that she even said that she was going to get back at me for that. So, she tells me that she sent me something in the mail, and I, I was happy. I said, okay. Um, when I actually got to the post office to pick up this package, the second the guy at the front desk picked it up and brought it over to me, I started to laugh. Um, I don't know if you'll be able to tell in this video, but she taped the entire box all with tape and it's really, really thick. So I guess she really meant it when she said she wanted to get back at me because I'll probably struggle a lot with this. But I don't, I guess I don't mind. Um, but anyway, I guess I'll get into unboxing it. Or at least trying to. Since she asked me to record this, um, I'll try to film as much of it as possible, if I could.
have to set this down. Let's see. So sticky. To any of you who knows what Durarara is or who's who have seen the anime, I really wish I had Shizuo here so he could rip apart this tape. So thank you so much, Sierra Kun, for taping the living hell out of this box. You taught me a valuable lesson when it comes to tape. So, as you can probably see, I only got that much so far, and there's still quite a bit to go. God. <sighs> Actually, I think that there should be a challenge each time we send packages to each other. Because while I am struggling, I actually do honestly find this extremely funny just because um I never received a, a box this taped ever in my life and not only that but one good thing about this is that the postal service probably would never even bother to open up a box this taped so Finally, I got to some box.
Okay, finally. After eight to ten minutes, I got it open. And guess what? It's wrapped inside. Thank you so much. First off, I have absolutely no idea what any of these are, but I have to say the wrapping paper is so adorable. Thank you so much. I have to show this off. So there's that one with the cute little bow. Then there's this. A letter. And then this with little sticky notes on it. So first off, the card. So um, as you may have seen from the original package, my name is not Claude, it is Amanda. But um, for those of you who know Black Butler, I consider Sierra my Aloise, and I am her Claude, although I would never kill her because I love her. She is one of my very best friends, and I really cherish our friendship, and I really, really, really appreciate these. And look at how cute. So I don't know if I'm going to read these out loud. It just depends on what they say. But I may. Okay. So it says... Hey, look at how lazy I am, writing this on my iPad instead of handwriting it. Also, the letters are really big, and I don't know how to make them smaller. Anyway, Merry Late Christmas, and Happy New Year. I hope you like these gifts. Now for some poetry. Roses are red, violets are blue, Shizuo is sexy and wants to make out with you. <laughs> I don't know what else to write, aha. Uh -huh. I love you and keep being amazing. Thank you so much. You have no idea how happy this makes me. And I think I'm going to frame this and put it in my room somewhere. And literally, if I have a picture frame to fix this, to, to fit this, I mean, I am framing this. Thank you so much. Okay, on to the rest. Okay, so this one says, so remember when I said I was going to send you Yaoi? Spoiler alert, that's what's in here. I got this a while ago, but never actually read past the 10th page. It's amazing how lazy I can be with reading, even if it's manga. So I'm giving it to you because I'm never going to finish it, and you most likely will. Enjoy. Thank you so much. I honestly cannot wait to see what kind of Yaoi it is. Spicy but sweet. I never heard of this, but it really looks amazing and yaoi ish. Even though that's not a word. But thank you so much. I'm definitely going to read this most likely tonight. Uh, or since my parents are out now, then probably now after I'm done filming this. Thank you so much. Okay, let's see. Sorry if I go through this a little faster, but uh, my camera's running out of memory. So, on to the next one. I don't want to rip these notes because I really do like them. Okay, so this one is, I found this and thought of you. I really hope you like it. I think it's adorable. so much it's so cute so it says I don't know if you can see this it says friends for a lifetime the beauty of life is experienced through the friendships we share thank you so much I'll put this on my desk definitely maybe I'll be able to take pictures too 
Okay, and now this one. So far I see cute little bears. So, if I could guess, I would imagine these are kind of like little graham crackers with bears on them and strawberry flavored. So thank you very much. I will definitely try these and probably like them because you probably don't know this, but strawberries are one of my favorite fruits. Thank you so much, Sierra Coon. I really, 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 really appreciate all this. I love your poem. This is adorable. Can't wait to read this and try them. Um, I just, I don't really even know what to say. I just am really excited and happy and just really grateful and I hope you know that I'm going to buy you a shit ton of stuff as soon as I'm able to um so hopefully I'll be able to send it within the next few months um I want to try to collect as much stuff as I can for you to send it all at once um and I promise you, you will need a chainsaw to get through all the tape. Maybe not. Um, that's kind of cruel. But I, I must say that I really did enjoy opening up this box. So thank you so much. Um, if anybody else has watched this, watched this other than you, um, just thank you for watching this video, checking it out. And hopefully I could post more um, unboxing videos in the future. So just thank you, and thank you so much, Sierra Coon. I really, really love all this. Thank you so much. And um, I guess I'll talk to you. I'll message you as soon as I can. All right, bye.